Get on social media. Get on social media. Get on social media. If you're a business owner, you hear this all the time from your people in your network. But with clients, meetings, lead generation, and all the stuff you have to do for your business and more, people don't have the time, resources, or knowledge to make their social media presence fruitful. So hi, I'm Shiley Hakimian of Your Social Media Sherpa. I wanna help you out. <laughs> I help solo business owners get seen by more of their hard-earned connections using social media platforms like LinkedIn. Who's on LinkedIn? I want all those hands raised next week. <laughs> Got it? <laughs> <sighs> so I facilitate down-to-earth, one-on-one learning sessions, helping clients feel empowered to reinvest in their own marketing by doing their own social media. So I've been working in social media officially for the last six years, but unofficially since all the way back in the days of MySpace. MySpace? Yeah? Huh? Love it. Uh, this in combination with being a speaker and a certified teacher, I think makes me suitable for this job. Extra, extra. So people tell me that they think their own social media is awful. Who, does anyone here think their own social media is awful? Some people, Rebecca's shaking her head, Rebecca's social media is on fleek, it's amazing. <laughs> Some people say that to me and I'm like, the fact that you even have a social media profile in the first place means you're already winning and that you already have a huge win in your hand. So before a, se a session, I take a deep dive uh, at clients' online presence and create custom social media goals that I can hold my clients accountable to. So one client noted that she loved the baby steps I gave her for her social media. Some example of clients I've worked with are real estate agents, chiropractors, photographers, and even an internet coach. Lots of people. Uh, one nugget that I want to share with all of you is to put yourself out there and show off your coolness on your LinkedIn profile. Future clients or employers are definitely going to look there and you want to look super duper cool when they do. You want to give them a sense that they've met you because they've seen your profile. So I hope you all do that, it's gonna be great. But if you're not uh, so inspired, uh, I wanna give you some ideas to make your LinkedIn profile extra freaking fabulous. Who wants a LinkedIn ideas, right? Yes, oh, I love it, I love it. Uh, <laughs> so for LinkedIn profile inspiration, go to my website, which is actually this, shai.ly, and on the top of that page, you will get a link that you can see all of my favorite LinkedIn profiles and get some really inspired ideas so you can get real cool on the internet. <laughs> so, uh, one of my goals is that I wanna offer more social media empowerment workshops. So I appreciate any introductions that you all can make to people who work in learning and development at companies like real estate offices, law, law firms, accounting firms, and beyond. Those would be amazing introductions. But besides that, social media is really dear to me. Uh, as someone who didn't always feel as socially connected as I do now, and I'm saying this having so many friends that I love and adore in this room, like I didn't have that growing up, and social media was the way that kind of changed my life. It brought me to the most amazing people that I could never imagine. <sighs> so, um, no matter the social media platforms that are today or next week or next year, it's all about the goodness you share with people and the trust you build with them. Social media is about the people not about your business. Provide for the people, and the people will provide for you. Thanks. Thank you, Shelly. So I follow you on LinkedIn, and you post some pretty amazing <laughs> videos. What was the last topic of video that you posted for a little extra push that other people should go to your LinkedIn profile? I'm a big Ben fan. I love you, Ben. You're great. Ben posts amazing workshops. Fantastic. So yes, my LinkedIn, I've had out of six videos now with over 20,000 people reach on social media on LinkedIn, which is all business people. Uh, and that's really huge, is that I'm getting in front of my network when I'm not actually with my network, which is one of the magical things you can do on LinkedIn right now. Uh, my last video was on the relationship between social media and networking. How can you use platforms like Twitter to get connected with people that you think are super duper awesome? For example, Shy Tribe got connected with a super duper famous celebrity because we tweeted at her and she talked to us, which is awesome. You have no idea, you're one click away from the person that could give you your future. So that was the last video and there's plenty more to come about how you can connect with people more personally using the tools of the internet. Thank you.